At SWI Pacific, we are committed to driving sustainable development and creating a positive impact on the environment, society and communities in which we operate. Sustainable development is a strategic imperative at SWI and we manage it through the group's sustainability strategy, SWI Thrive. Under the strategy, we've identified five core areas, climate, water, waste, people and communities. Delivering SWI Thrive has required that we set ambitious targets, including net zero emissions, water neutrality and zero waste to landfill, all by 2050. In setting our transition plans to achieving these goals, it was vital for us to set near-term targets, including a 50% reduction in Scope 1 and Scope 2 emissions by 2030, 65% of waste to be diverted from landfill by 2030, and a 30% reduction in water withdrawal from a 2018 frozen efficiency baseline. These targets provide the business with greater clarity and focus and help drive near-term action in line with the level of ambition needed to achieve the long-term commitments. 2024 marks the fourth year for Swire as a Tier 1 corporate sponsor for Rethink HK. As a business operating in multiple sectors, we want to share with others how we are embedding sustainability in our business practices at both the sector level and as a conglomerate. Swire Group will be sharing their current initiatives around nature, the circular economy, facilities management, talent development and sustainable transportation. My contribution this year is part of the Sustainable Horizons programme on what I hope will be a fascinating panel discussion exploring Hong Kong's progress on its road to net zero. Our ambition is to achieve net zero emissions by 2050 and a 50% reduction in our direct emissions by 2030. To accelerate our progress, Twy Properties and Swy Coca-Cola have set science-based targets aligned with the 1.5 degree pathway and approved by the Science-Based Targets Initiative. Currently, 88% of our Scope 1 and 2 emissions and 34% of our Scope 3 emissions are covered by these science-based targets. For emission reduction, Swy Coca-Cola has committed to sourcing 100% renewable energy for its core operations by 2026. Currently, seven of its bottling plants in the Chinese mainland business have implemented 100% renewable energy. Swire Properties have established performance-based targets on embodied carbon for key materials, i.e. concrete, rebar and structural steel. Meanwhile, recognising the importance of sustainable aviation fuel in curtailing carbon emissions for our air transportation sector, Cathay Pacific has set a target for sustainable aviation fuel to constitute 10% of its total fuel consumption by 2030. We are excited about the opportunity to share our expertise and foster meaningful discussions at Rethink HK 2024, helping businesses navigate their sustainability journeys and drive impactful change. Please join me and my colleagues from across the SWI group of companies at Rethink HK this September. See you there.